Flexual Elements said, Welcome back everyone to E6E. Today we are finally unlocking the gate that is blocking us from actually 20 things as well as showing our new building and way of getting resource E. S that doesn't take 20 hours. How are you today, Mr. God? Oh, fine, tired, but fine. I know, I just struggle with some words. I think it's because there's supposed to be a comma in between resource and S. Maybe. Oh. Uh, right, yeah, well, we don't. Um, we've made some improvements. Um, I upgraded the energizing rods two tiers up. We went from hardened, it was basic hardened, blazing, and then narcotic, and then there's an emerald one, and there's a the red one after this. But we're limited. Anything past this, we're actually limited by cables and battery, so there's no point in going past this right now. Um, I kind of changed up the uh, the pressurized stuff with the fact that we're going to be implementing the new thing, which is going to be attached to this. Um, we've got our UV light box, which is for the circuits. We've got an etching tank, which is for the circuits. Um, we found that the fuel wood heater um, is enough to get the temperature up to the correct 1700, which anybody watching and struggling, this is how you do it. 1700 degrees Celsius needs to be something like this. Standard liquids don't do it. You have to have something. If you don't do it this way, there's only one other or two other items that can do it, and they are crazy mechanism stuff. Um, we've got this thing burning, making steel, which we had before. This thing's making coal coke. Uh, what else did we do inside base? We've prepped a load of stuff. Nothing's really changed since the last episode in here. Um, we've got all of our assembly machine stuff, which is on my top left. This is all prepped. This is going to be a pain, actually, because we've got to do all of this from the, um, this is all got, keep them in those lines, by the way. We, we need them individually separate like this. Um, we need to do that by create. So we're going to have to go outside and use the create system. We've prepped a couple other machines and a couple of things that we're kind of waiting on. Um, or we're waiting for, we cannot make half of the stuff that we want. On my top left, half of this stuff cannot be made until we've got these assemblers, which sucks. Um, this is all the B stuff, <clears throat> which uh, my slave driver partner asked me to make because she was too lazy working. Like what a simp, right? Working for the man. Um... I made a load of tier one apres, which was a pain actually. Um, so this is enough to make tier one to tier two, and then tier two to tier three. We can't make tier four because it's too high. And the reason we've got all this <laughs> is because of a building that she made and I take zero credit for. The only thing that I did really was Help her figure out the dimensions of the thing because she had no idea why. And there's a why is there a block there? I mean, okay, there's a dirt block on the side there. Um, this is our new B storage area, I guess you would call it. Nice elevator going up. There's enough for eight apres in this building. Um, we're gonna have to hook it up and get the bees in here. We, go, we, we kind of decided what bees were doing over at the new, or oh, the old bee location. There's one of each type of bee that I could find. There are some bees that are not on this list because some of them require you to do like mutations and stuff. Load of oak drawers for, for the stuff, upgrades for the stuff. The bottom line stuff is the one that we're probably not going to use. Um, these are all excess bees from previous stuff. Quite annoyingly, actually, I don't know, I didn't tell you this, but I went, I made a load of bees, including like an ender bee. Um, I made that thing and then went inside the house uh, earlier and found that there was an ender bee in there. So you'd already got one. 
So I had to like go searching for the fucking thing, and it wasn't out here with the rest of the bees. It was inside the building, which was rather annoying. I also found like five fucking obsidian bees when um, I did find one, and yeah. But this has been rocking our uh, this single thing. It's no nothing in it right now because I took them all out, but. Every one of these, like, blocks of honeycomb, we can't do it the way we want to do it, but if you have it in block form, it's a 50% chance to produce nine copper chunks. Or maybe it's 50% chance per copper chunk, I don't know. But it's a lot of copper and it's a lot of gold. Um, each individual one does different things. There's some alloy ones in here. Um, Problem is, you can only run standard honeycomb through this, not um, not blocks. And I wonder if you can guess, but the reason we haven't done the blocks is because you need the multi-block structure, and we can't build the multi-block structure until you get the assembly machines. <laughs> Everything is gated. So we're going to try and get that running. There's a couple of things that we want it, we need it for. Yeah, we need it for the Hellfire Forge. We need it for the Metallurgical Infuser. We need it for the Draw Controller. We need it for the Central Feudal con uh, Blocks so that we can make the, the big boy. Um, I think we need it. Don't we need it for the Stable Wormhole thing as well at some for some reason? I can't remember. Maybe not. I can't remember. There's a rich. Yeah, that's, that is a ritual, but isn't there a reason we can't do it? I'm sure there's a there's a specific thing we need. We made them, didn't we? We did. We managed to make them. Yeah. Okay. So the for this uh, this is what I was talking about with the machine. Yeah. We need to so to make these was a pain for this virulent mix, and this requires 1,700 degrees Celsius, which you can only get from that heater. And with the heater, top tip, I found that it didn't actually reach the temperature you want. You have to time in a bottle the the heater to speed it up. And I don't know if that's a glitch or if it's an intended mechanic, but if you let it gradually get up to there, I don't think it will ever get up to the temperature. It loses too much. But if you tick accelerate it, it kind of burns it so fast it does get up to a high temperature very quickly. I made a load of these uh, niotic crystals and spirited crystals. I didn't make all of these. Some of these were quest rewards. Um, I did make all of these runes of air, fire, water, all that kind of stuff because she forced me to. Working my fingers to the bone. Where are you? Right. Are you what? What do you want to do? Do you want? Are you going to help me build these assemblers? I'm I'm happy there's a mob over there. Kill it and move on. I don't know. She's she's like dreaming of stuff over there. I don't know what's going on. So I'll get started on the. Uh, are you sure you don't want to help with the um, the tedious process of building these things? Four, two, two, and two. I assume it should work. Man, this is so much faster than it was before. Wow, that's so much faster. <laughs>
I haven't used it. I, I literally, I upgrade. Well, I didn't upgrade it. I, I kind of made it faster. And uh, see what I am going to do. I'm going to take this box outside with me. Oh, you give me the box back, you little thief. Always thieving stuff. Okay. Machine or go there. Ring. Pipe, 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 and pipe, and then not that, not that. Oh, baby, go. Should be roughly the same design. It's that, 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 and that. Interesting thing is going to be putting this machine together because I'm going to be honest, I'm not sure I can remember. Oh, this one, typically, this one's different. Even that's different. So I don't Well, what have you done? Oh, that's always fun. There we go, production line. Now I've got to go and set this stupid thing up. And I'm going to be completely honest. I've only set this machine up like once or twice that I can even remember. And I'm not 100%. I know how to do it.
this may actually be worth looking to see what's in the book. And if I can find which book it is, that one. Not that one. I mean, we have gold. What's the beef? There's gold leaves in the nature's aura thing inside the building. Leaf turn into dust. And there's, I think, like three stacks of it inside the building in the nature's aura chest. Just having a quick Google to see if I can uh, see if I can see how this thing set up. I think it's three by three. So controller. I think the platform goes in the middle. Export. Import. Laser and drill. Uh, it's a big plus, right? What? No, what to place it down? No, it's um, one block away from the pedestal in a line of three on all four sides, and then the corners are one block inside that. Problem, no program. Insert a assembly program into the controller. I think it's working. I'm not sure, but I think. Did you figure out? Well, that's not really a, a response. It's either yes or no. Yeah, cool. Yeah, so.
Ja, så var det. Ja. I guess I'll try and make this stupid thing. So I need a machine frame. Which is one of these. Which is a rough. Rough needs a coated. And the coated is that in there. So I need to use the drill program with two machine frames from Thermal. I swear to God, I just made some of these. Well, need trees to turn into gold. Any ideas for what? What for what? For powder? Why? Why? Why powder? Gold powder. I, look, I, I told you, there's some inside the chest. Because they were inside in the Nature's Aura one. But you might you might want to if you're turning that to dust, you might want to do it on the nature's aura altar. It gives you double the yield. If you just convert it in your inventory, it gives you two. If you do it on the altar, it gives you four. Real real Could be two of them. It's running. Are you help you come in? Come watch. It's doing things. All right. It's inside your weirdo. Do some speed up roads, I'm gonna be on. Okay, speed up road a little bit faster. So depending on what the action is, so to use this, you uh little control panel at the back here, you put the program in that it wants. And then you put the items in this chest, and then it does them, and then moves them over to this chest. And that gives you a machine frame top. And then we need to put that into the thermo pneumatic processing plant with molten plastic. And it needs 1600 temperature, which means I'm going to need to put what it's done. Uh... 
boost. Okay, we've got a coated machine. And then this with two invar plates and a machine base gives us one. Let that carry them. And then we can have some other machine base. Invar plate. In a stampy doodad. Stampy doodads outside. A word of warning to anybody that is uh, considering doing what we're doing. Don't. <laughs> just, just don't. I beg of you, it is not worth your time. <laughs> I mean, I, if you're looking for a long-term pack and you've got patience, like a lot of patience, it could be worth doing. It could be. But what's frustrating about it, so unlike, this is in, in my own opinion. Um, in my opinion, the um, this pack is pretty good, but it's just the fact that some things you just want to physically like claw your eyes out about. But other packs, like say Greg Tech, Greg Tech is known to be a quite an intensive pack and it has lots of stuff. Yeah, this isn't hard. Greg Greg Tech is very complex, but it's very linear, as in you you get from one step to the next step and you have to make all of these machines. But once you've made these machines, you're good. On this pack, yeah, you you get gate locked, as she said, you get gate locked by one thing and you have to spend God knows how long in crafting a load of other stuff. When if we say it takes it's taken three or four hours, I'm not exaggerating. I had to make twenty-four crafts, I think it was twenty-four crafts um last night of the um the power. Crystal that I'm going to show on my screen. Where is it? I, I made spirited crystals. The recipe is an Osiris God Shard and two uranium dust. Very easy. With the God Shards, we only had a limited amount, which is why I only made 20 something of them. Um, that gave us like 50 something. 6 million FE. So that, with this thing, that was before these were upgraded because I couldn't make these until I'd done. I, I did it the stupid way around. I'm going to be honest. I did the, I did the most time-consuming one first because that's we needed less of, or we, we had to make less of them. What I should have done is I should have made the, um, I should have made them the the next time round. I should have done them the other way around. Basically, it was my own. My own stupid fault. All right, that's doing that. These things can put in here, right? Pretty sure we need multiple of these, so I'm just going to do this. All the bee things. Are you being careful? No, not even in the slightest. <laughs> Bonk, bonk, bonk. That gives me three more of them. I've, so I've made four of these annoying ass frame things. 
right here. Which that machine should play with. Yeah, turn that off because it's screaming that we've got too much pressure. Oh yeah, top tip for anybody uh, watching. Um, I like to give tips if I know them. Security upgrades are kind of required. You hear that machine that was just going then, it was screaming at us because it was uh, it was overpressured. If you go into the red, pipes and stuff start exploding, machines start exploding. If you have the um, if you have the security upgrade, it won't blow them up. Is basically what it will do. It will release the pressure rather than using the pressure. Just a little bit of information. All right, so that has made, hopefully, a machine frame. She's staring at it. A good blind if he's staring at it. Yeah, we do. We there's a lot of achievements that we need to progress. Some of them were even longer than that. I'm going to be honest. Oh motherfucker! I forgot about these. So we need to make these basic control circuits. Um, how do you? Oh my god. We didn't prep this. Why didn't we do this? Why have you done this to me? Silicon lumen coins. We even have lumen. We do. We, we spent quite literally like 20 minutes before we started recording, just making sure that we had the stuff to start progressing because we didn't want to start the episode and then we do these episodes in an hour chunk and we didn't want to start it and then immediately like have to stop because we just didn't have enough. Um, that's a very weird number, 24? I need process, I need silicon flux, I need to use the compressed machine again. And for, I mean, silicon. I, do you just break that machine? I need that. I literally. <laughs> Please tell me you didn't just break it. Are you lying to me? I made them. I was about. I was about to do the okay things on the end. No, it doesn't. We can't, to be fair, we can make the bigger version of it now. There's actually a, there's a, you can make a 5x5 five five version of it. We can do, but, um, yeah, fuck it, throw it here. I don't know, we've got enough space actually. Five by five. Can you uh oh, wait? I do this without breaking it. 
I'm going to be honest. I don't actually, wait, how many, is this five by five? No, maybe that's a bad idea. I'm changing my mind. I'm changing my mind. This isn't, I don't think this is enough blocks. I'll worry about that later. It's too, it's too much effort to do right now. I'll just put them in the thoughts. Um, I'm glad I didn't break it. Can you wait? Because it's going to lose all of its pressure as soon as you do that. I mean, uh, just, I guess we're just... Uh... Did you get it all? Hey, Dan, put it back. I don't think you need to grab them, right? But wait, no, 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 Is they so they're like they're, they're like solo directional. So to do the output side, you have to like place it on the other side. Why do you always get these things? I I truly don't understand. By the way, how you always seem to get the drops. Are you telling me you're hacking? Are you telling me you're hacking? She's cheated. Confirmed. Confirmed. It's confirmed. Right, I need that, that, and that. Mm. Which, which quest? Um, mine, you, it, it's tied. Yeah, it's got, you got to do the refinery controller. You got to build a refinery controller and four refinery outputs for that to work. And then you get plastic sheet and then you get printed circuit board and then you can get the assembler. So if you want to work on that refinery controller and the refinery output. Not the refinery controller, no, we've never built it.
பசங்க Um, there's one item I can go and pick up that we have done. Workbench. The iron mechanical components, I think, are inside. Pissy machine frame, I think, is inside as well. Um, man, I've got. This is this is what drives you crazy. Is some of this stuff we've made, but we've now got to remake. This is an example. I've got to turn a blaze rod into the blazing rod, which is done as a 10 mil. So we've got to spend 10 mil of power to make this rod because it's part of the achievement. And the mechanical metallurgical infuser, we won't get the achievement for that until we've done it. So we have to make this. The other thing is, uh, we've make this. I've got to make this thing, which is printed circuits basic memory chips which uh, i don't is there another way to do this because i'm guessing there isn't So yet again, we've either got something that's gating us or something that's going to take forever. We have to make a basic memory chip, which is a prepared memory chip. Which is RAM chips with an unassembled PCB. My God, this is ridiculous. And make an unassembled PCB, which we don't have any left. I'm pretty sure I changed them all. Which is an empty PCB in this, which is one of these. Uh, something on the list to do, PCB honeycomb. Might save us some time. How hard is that to get? <laughs> Go 
there's a PCB B. It says, what do you get if you lube up a iron B, shove it inside a pneumatic helmet and toss it inside a pressure chamber? That sounds to me like you need um, lubricate, lubricant, an iron B and a pneumatic helmet. Would be my guess. Yep, it is. Bucket of lubricant, an iron B, and a pneumatocraft helmet. A pneumatocraft helmet is made. You know what? I might actually do this. I think it's worth it. I, I think it's actually worth it. Oh my god, it's a sequence craft. Why does this happen? Why does this why does this keep happening? Compressed iron. One of them. The sequence graph there. You need five, five compressed iron ingots. One, two, three, four, five. My inventory is so full right now. <laughs> um, put some of this back. Uh, that back, that back. I'm losing to the will to live, by the way. <laughs> I'm like totally losing my will to live. Thank fuck we got some of them. So just just for for reference here, what I'm doing, I want there's a there's a B that you can get that actually produces the things that we need. And we've got access to, to do that stuff. So it's being fucking done. Because, yeah. So this is a sequence graph that I need a stamper thing. And then four of them. Just so you know, you are completely and totally on your fucking own right now. I am having a pain in the ass time with this. So good job there's not a baby here because I would be eating it right now. What? What? Why didn't you work? Oh, it's not running. Oh. You overstressed, you son of a bitch. That's right, you better fucking work. I, I'm not even sure I want to know what you're doing, to be honest. I'm 73. Come on. If 
So I'm having to do a create like crafting job to make a compressed iron helmet, which will then let me make a thing to be able to put through the assembler, which will give us your pneumatic helmet, a pneumatic helmet in a pressure chamber with an iron B and a bucket of lubricant will give us a PCB B and that will quite literally give us honeycombs and the honeycombs um, when put through a centrifuge can give you PCBs or iron ingots. It also gives you etching acid like as a as a honey. So it's actually kind of worth. It's not a very high chance, but like PCBs and compressed iron with etching acid, like I don't see a downside. Should be able to turn this up now. Move back in here, give him a bit of hell. You still doing the achievements? It's taking you so long. So slow. No, I'm not looking at it. It's your job. <laughs> I refuse. I utterly refuse. <laughs> Is it real? Yeah. Sounds fun. I know. Well, this is the same. Like, so the only reason I'm doing this is because I want, like, we need empty PCBs. And empty PCBs are like a crafting thing that you have to put into the pressure chamber. So if we can just have them ticking over, like, we seem to be using this stuff for like everything. So. We've got an electron B. How how much do you need? I mean it it's literally um there you go. There's some you've got some making in here, a couple of stacks making in there in the induction just for short term because the b is not particularly fast right now we uh we should prioritize making the centrifugal controller and centrifugal casing because it's literally our resources All right unpacked helmet Unpacked helmet goes back in with a laser. Like to me, this just seems needlessly pointless. Like I've just had to make a helmet assembly package that then goes into this thing with a drill program, turns into a unpacked version, and then you've got to rerun it through the exact same machine with a different assembly program, the laser to turn into the actual helmet. So you have to run it through this machine twice.
need an IMB. Pretty sure that is lubricant, yep. Apparently we needed that. That, that, and I need an IMB. I don't know how many IMBs we have, do you? Kind of hoping more than one. We don't have more than one. How do you make an IMB? Forest and Sandy. Right, I'm stealing this IMB. We're going to have to just make a new one. Take note of that. We're going to have to make a new one. little B bitch is going into this thing. You, you, and you. This should give us a PCB B. PCB B. You, you little motherfucker, are gonna, I'm going to put this guy actually in the, uh, in the apiary. This one. And speed his little ass up. Hopefully he doesn't need a special special thing. He does. Son of a bitch. He needs a you don't happen to have plastic construction brick, do you? Oh, that's not a bad to make. Yeah, no, we don't have any. Looks like fucking Lego. Oh, doesn't that look like Lego? You've got your stupid pollen thing. Get to work, you little pansy. Nice. I really want to make this the um I really want to make the central fusual thing, but I'm trying to make the metallurgical infuser right now. Um I kind of feel like it's more important, but this is a gigantic pain in the ass. Are these used for anything else? They don't appear to be. Okay, I can turn them all. And then some RAM. Proof processors.
No, I need an unassembled. I still need an unassembled PCB. <laughs> After all that, I still need one. Copper six and two, right? Six. Copper. Bulag. Give me that sweet, sweet PCB. Right, can it be the completely fucked one or do I have to like... Do we have a basic capacitor? Basic capacitor. Are you talking about the power ones? Yes, we do. So it has to be, you have to etch it. These have to be lighted up. Speed. Must have speed. Uh, yeah, that one you can, yeah. That, that won't do any damage. As long as you put it back. I'll make sure you put the upgrades back in it. And, uh, stuff. And the, uh, program. What am I using this for? What am I making this for? Uh, I'm going to need more than this, aren't I? Uh, six, seven, eight. Ready? Uh, they're on me. I've got the drill one on me. But it should, if it's on me, it should just, those achievements are shared between us. So whatever you do, I do. But if, it, if I've got something on me, it should just count. Uh, can do. I, I have no idea how um, how complex is it to be. Well, I said we can do it. How how hard is it to do? Is there anything we're missing? It's the occult ritual for the spectral. We've got that. We've got that. We've got that. Have we got the foliate book? We've got a foliate book. Um.
is this ritual we can do it yeah um let me grab that 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 and that you grab the frame and the other items we need and very quickly go and do it Just have a look to see where the ritual is. That one, it's this one. What's the ritual called? This is where it gets funky because the ritual that it wants is not necessarily the ritual that. Um, Can you uh, protect me for a minute? Just kill these mobs. It's a stable wormhole that we need, right? So you have to do the spectral compulsion, which is this ritual. Let me You give me these candles. Complete, right? Well, uh, it's just the foliage book in the middle, right? You get it? Nice. Have you got a program on you? Did you steal them? I'm 100% sure there should be another one. Oh, it's in there, another one. It's in a different chest. So these need the drill. Oh, if you do drill and laser, you can do both at the same time. Okay. A little quicker. Uh, I think I destroyed it. Why? We weren't using it. Just use one of the others. We, I haven't used the cooking pot in ages. So just, yeah.
Uh, now this is the next step that we're completely and utterly screwed. We have to have a fluid encapsulator with memory essence. How, pray tell, do we get memory essence? Bottles of enchanting in a centrifugal separator gives us essence of knowledge, which can be then changed to memory essence. How many bottles of enchanting do we have? Holy shit, you need... You need eight buckets per memory chip. Eight. We need two of those chips to make a single thing of basic control circuits. Man, this is ridiculous. There's got to be a better way of getting these. How do you make bottles of enchanting? Mm. The RGB B has a chance of giving you them. Bottles of enchanting for one percent chance there. Villager trade. So you can do it in an infusion recipe from the from an enchanting table. 20 levels with a honey bottle gives you gives you um you can do bigger ones but you have to have higher returner as a cooking recipe but you need a mini a mimi carnation which i have no idea where you get that from do you know have you ever seen that mimi carnation It says it's from the never. So also, I think it spawns if you put rich soil in a completely dark area in there, but I'll some time them out from spawn in there, but, but they light up the area which prevents more of them to spawn, so maybe multiply three by three. So we need to find some way of getting essence, like like XP essence. A mob crusher would do it. But you need an advanced machine frame for it, which is from a dissolution chamber. Well, like everything on this pack is just like a kick in the nuts. Yeah, yeah, it makes sense. I 
I kind of feel like that's that's a fair deal. If we've if we've done something and it's an absolute bitch to make, and it's been we've been gated because of something else, then I don't see why we shouldn't. Leaded, like I know, I know we've had leaded concrete. I had to make it for that. Uh, while you're doing it, spawn in a, a leaded concrete. Leaded concrete, we've made it before because I had to make them for that um, machine over here. But it's unnecessary just to make one. Mechanical iron components, I'm pretty sure we've got some of them somewhere. Needed what? Uh, we needed the enchanted. We needed it for something else. We've used one already. We've made one already. We did. It's it's you also. Um, you also needed them to make the pure purple chalk, the impure purple chalk, which we made the other day. You needed one for that as well. We've used it a couple of times. It's in the occultism box in the corner over there. Left, 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 left. Over here. Afrit Essence and Weak Blood Shards we've got somewhere as well. On. Why didn't that count? Okay, so if you're in the terminal, it doesn't count. Red chalk, I, hopefully we can make the red chalk now. Um, we haven't made it. It requires the tier 4 blood orb, we, or the, blood, the tier 4 altar, we haven't had a chance to make it yet. It looks like we could, but we haven't. Um, Ultra of Burfin, where's that? Have you made one of them? Have we made the altar of earth in? So we, we apparently need to make one of them and then we've got the Gloria Imus or Aminus and then we've got the altar and we've got the offering table. 
and after that I can then make the Starlight Crafter, which we've I've got the materials to make that basically the Starlight. So you need to make an altar. You need well, you need to make honey glazed ham, and then altar of birthing. Altar of birthing, I don't know. I don't remember making it because it requires a summoning crystal, and I don't remember even ever making one of them. Well, I'm kind of gated again by memory essence. Where is the um the X do you remember the XP things, the books and stuff you were using? It's kind of chess. I don't remember which chest it is. There isn't one. What? Am I missing something? Where's the chest? Oh, yeah. I was wondering, is there any way? I don't think there is. That's going to be a bit of a conundrum. Might need to do that. You might need to so say there's an item from Thermal that you can get insightful crystal used to store experience. You can use that and then it says allows XP to be stored and retrieved in a knowledge concentrator. That's an upgrade of some description. I wonder if you can put that into a machine and it will suck out the essence and turn it into liquid. If it is, then that's the only way we're making that. I mean, bottled sunlight, greater... That's actually not that hard to make. These are a little bit funky. Wait, how do you... How do you get them? How do you get experience gems from ours? Do you know or do you not know?
I'm looking through the R's book. It's not in the R book. Someone says that you need to use a tablet of disintegration on a ritual blazer. Power with a full source jar as as mobs walk into the field produced by the blazer, they will turn into XP gems. So tablet of inter disintegration on a ritual blazer, power with a full source jar, and then as mobs walk into the field produced by, by the blazer, they will turn into an XP gem. That doesn't sound too hard, but we need, I need like 16 of them to be able to make the, um, to make an insightful crystal, and then a further 16 to make a knowledge Concentrator. Are we stopping the, uh, the recording? I annoyingly, I, I legitimately can't finish the infuser because you need control circuits and the control circuits are made using the thing that I'm doing. So unless we've got a metric ton of bottles of enchanting somewhere. Thirty eight. It's two hundred and fifty per vial per bottle. It's not enough. Or a trove. Uh, no, I haven't. We've made an aura cash. We've made an aura cash which is basically an aura trove. It's just four infused rock and four and go to the sky. But we haven't made the actual trove.
that's another thing we could do. So for the essence, all right, let me finish this, this word. So for the essence, we could make a essence pump upgrade for our backpack, which lets you pump essence between the a tank upgrade and the player. So I'm assuming that you could pump it back from the player to the backpack, which would give you essence. That requires a Daijin book of binding with a higher binding thing. With again, you still have to have the R's crystals. But that could be that could be a way of getting it. It just depends on that ritual. It's it's that ritual. The higher binding ritual is the one that's gonna it's the higher binding ritual that's the problem. Yeah, there's not much we can do now on this, so we're just going to have to wait until um <laughs> fail. Higher binding. So it looks like we could probably do the higher binding. Elements but... said, yeah. Thanks for watching everyone. Sorry for the longer episode of us completing all the random achievements. We hope you enjoyed and we'll catch you in the Flex One Show Us Out, Mr. God. Bye, everybody. Yeah. Stopped. Yeah, we bonus clip. Yeah, we just, um, very quickly, one of the reasons we were we were struggling is to make the memory chips. Um, to make this memory chip, you had to have memory essence. Um, we didn't re I didn't actually see this tab when I was looking. So it turns out that you can actually get a memory stick with a curio, very easy to make. Uh, I'll give Tina full credit. She thought she was she was looking at my screen and um, what she noticed it. Uh, very easy to make, and you can literally charge this thing using your own XP. And um, once you've charged it using your own XP, you can just right-click a tank and it gives you the essence. So I managed to make the, the chips, essentially, very easily. A lot easier than they should have been. Um, I then put those into a packager, which then put them into this stupid thing, which is then yielded the control circuits. Now, the control circuit, none of this is going to give us achievements because we need to make this advanced RAM chip, which we need reinforced alloy, which is lithium. And lithium is just a whole extra process. We'll work on that off camera. We should be able to make the infuser, which is also one of the things gating us. Uh, we need all of that. Please let this be working. Infuser. Mother of Christ. Throw you down there. All right, you be a good infuser. Um, the other thing we want to make very quickly is the central fusion controller because this thing is actually gating our progression as well. Um, apparently we need... This chest in the middle isn't visible, by the way. It's like not visible to the, uh, to the WASIT system. Oh, uh, move, 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 move. Thank you. Right, and this. Can I make another one of these quickly? Yes, I can. It'll save me going outside and making it. Sweet. Now this 
Uh, what the, well, it was a, it was an achievement, but this is a three by three by four thing, so we're gonna have to make some more casings. But this will essentially let us centrifuge big blocks rather than the individual honeycombs. So we can just hook this up and just set it going, and hopefully it's a lot more efficient. Um, yeah, we don't have any more machine frames. I'm gonna I'm gonna need to make some more machine frames before I can uh, actually make this, but that's uh, it's not not much of a problem. It's just a, a load of effort. So yeah, uh, that should be it, and we'll make that off camera, and then we'll have more resources, and hopefully the end of uh, the end of us having to mine because we've got a shit ton of bees that can do all sorts of the stuff. I never actually before we shut out, I never actually saw what. Um, Oh, you didn't put it in here. I thought you would actually. Oh, I guess we'll do that off camera. I thought she'd uh, she'd put the apries into the new building, but I guess we'll do that off cam. It's not achievements or progress, so that's fine. We'll uh, we'll take it from there. I don't. Is there anything on the infuser that we can do like right this second that we desperately need? Or the reason we wanted something. Where is it? There was an alloy. I'm sure there's an alloy. Alloy. This one. It is. Redstone. Energized steel. I'm going to do that super quick. Uh, energized steel is here. Redstone. So this, what I'm doing here, is gating. It's not well. It's not gating. It's um, infused alloys are what's required for us to upgrade all of our piping. Any piping, any cabling, anything at all like that is made using this. It also um, would allow us to make uh the basic energy cube oh you need lithium for that um which would be a uh, a big upgrade so we've got some of them so we can now upgrade some of our, our cables cool that's it we're gonna go and have a break because we're tired <laughs>